from Easter Valleys, and for today's experiment, we'll be making ivory sofas. Before you get any of your materials out, make sure to protect the surface you'll be working on with placemats or paper bags. For this experiment, you'll need a bowl with some water in it, ivory soap, it has to be ivory soap, not other soap, a plastic knife or a butter knife, some paper and a pair of scissors, a straw or a skewer, and tape. You can also have some small toys to put in your book. Before you start, make sure to write down what you think is going to happen when you put the boat in the water. That's your hypothesis. So, here's what your boat will look like when you're finished. The first step is to take the soap out of the wrapper. Next, you're going to carve with a plastic knife whatever design you want into the boat. Once your boat is carved, you're going to take your straw or your skewer and cut it to the length you want. Once you've done that, you're going to take your paper and cut out the size flag that you want. Once you've done that, you're going to get your tape and tape the flag to the skewer. You can cut out any flag design you want. Once you're done with that, you can put your flag in your boat. And you're done. Now that you're done with your boat, you can see what happens. Make sure to look back at your hypothesis from earlier so you can compare it to what happens. Now put your boat in the water. Three, two, one. The boat floats. How cool is that? So why does stuff float? Water is made up of things called molecules and those molecules stick together really well, water specifically. So when you try to put something on the water, the water is gonna stick together until something's heavy enough that it breaks. So ivory soap, is less dense than water, so it stays on top. Anything more dense than water will sink and break the surface tension. Thanks for tuning in. Hope to see you next time at our next cool Beast Robotics at Home experiment.